Internet Explorers. I'm in Taipei and you guys might have heard about Taiwanese night markets and how fun they are, but I'm here to show you another side of the market, the traditional markets, the Tong Sitsang. These are traditional markets that are on almost every um, neighborhood in Taiwan. You can always go to one, there's always one nearby, and they sell different wares and stuff like that. These markets are open really early in the day, um, from like 9 o'clock in the morning, and they close really early too, at 2.30 afternoon. These are geared more towards housewives and early workers who come here to get breakfast, get their daily groceries, and get their errands done before a day's work. They sell everything here from clothes to fruits to meats to even services like they sell there's a store here that actually sells kitchen knives and sharpens them for you too so you get a lot of stuff done here in just this one little street of markets these are bamboo shoots and they're one of my favorite things to eat I'm like a panda when I was little I used to live in Seattle but I come back to Taiwan for the summer to learn Chinese and on the way from the apartment to school I'd cut across this um, traditional market with my mom so this definitely brings back memories this is especially the snack shop because there's a lot of snacks here that I grew up eating like these lemon cream wafers which are the bomb coffee obviously the rice crackers these are really good rice crackers see this brand this is a very popular brand in Taiwan called Wang Wang. They serve really good snacks. And these are traditional sodas. They're called marble sodas because there's a marble at the top of this. And when you buy it, the um, owner will give you a little um, opener and you like you, pop, you push the marble down onto the soda so it opens it up and you can drink it because the marble is kind of the cap. And then when you finish drinking it, you can keep the marble and then you play around with it. So that's really cool. So I grew up drinking that too. A lot of Taiwanese food here is very pork based because a lot of Taiwanese people here don't eat beef for religious or cultural reasons. Uh, but they do sell beef and chicken here, but the majority of their meat is pig and they eat all of it. From the intestines to the feet to the ears to the snout, they eat all of it. And because Taiwan is also an island, it's also very seafood based as well. See these? This keeps flies away. Since this is a pretty, you know, casual market, you can assume it's all cash only and you can bargain for the prices. They're more than happy to make you a deal because they want to sell their wares. They're only here until 2.30 in the afternoon anyway, so they want to sell it quickly. So we definitely try to bargain with them. All this shopping has made me hungry, so I'm getting an oyster omelet, which is actually a Taiwan delicacy. I love it. It's my favorite thing to eat when I'm in Taiwan. It's an oyster omelet, oyster pancake, you can call it whatever it is, but it's basically egg with some batter and oysters thrown into it, fresh oysters, and covered with a little lettuce and some special sweet sauce, and it's really good. In um, Taiwanese, it's called Oa Jian. In Chinese, it's called He Zai Jian. And these are the characters to look out for. I've been here since it opened at 9 a.m. It's been almost an hour, and people are starting to flood in. It's getting really crowded. Keep in mind that this is a street, so you're gonna see some motorcycles coming by, and it's pretty narrow, so just stand on the side of the street when you hear motors running. Just be careful and just be safe.